How effective is the combination of your main product, the trailer, and the ancillary texts, poster and website? From the very beginning of my project, as my planning developed and I analysed two different film products, it made me realise that the consistency between the three products is very important. Making sure that the mise-en-scene that is displayed on all the products remains the same throughout such as the props which are used by the characters, the costumes which the characters are wearing, the settings of where the images are taken and where the film is taking place and the actors being used are the same throughout and are also playing the same role. Another key feature which needs to be kept consistent throughout is the institutional information that is displayed on all of the products and making sure that the same release date has been on the poster, website and trailer, making sure that it is obvious to the audience that the three products are from the same brand. An effective and easy way of doing this is making sure that the house style is kept consistent throughout the making of all three of the products. The house style which is used makes it recognisable for the audience which products are from which brand. An example of this would be if I use red and black on my posters, the same colours would need to be used on my website and also used in the captions and text which is used throughout my trailer. Whilst producing my poster, website and trailer, I made sure I was very careful to make sure all the detail and the features which I included on them used consistent colours, designs and mise-en-scene. Throughout make it, taking my main image, I strongly thought about the setting of where it was taken and thought in advance of where my main setting was going to be whilst recording my trailer. Because of my chosen genre, it was relevant for a lot of my footage to be filmed within the house. The main image which I used was of the male and the female character in bed as the main focus of the trailer was that something strange was happening whilst they were asleep. Therefore I felt this image was the most relevant for my poster. This main image was also used on my website to display consistency and this also clearly displays that the poster and website are from the same brand. The room which I took my main image was the room which I mainly focused on throughout my entire trailer which is why they both link. This was the bedroom. Throughout the trailer, both the characters were dressed in normal clothes which would be expected to wear when they are in the house. This was because these characters were displayed as normal people so didn't have to wear any specific costumes to portray any type of character. The actors which were used were a male and a female character. Having only two characters was relevant for my genre and these two characters stayed the same throughout all three of my products. For all three of my products, the same release date was used, the 31st of the 10th, 2012. I chose this date as I thought it was generic as the date chosen is the date of Halloween. I made sure the release date was the same on all three of my products. This was to make sure consistency was displayed and if my three products had different d release dates, the audience would be confused as all the other features display that the products are from the same brand from the release, apart from the release date. My chosen institution company was Film District. The logo was displayed at the beginning of my trailer, at the bottom of my website and the bottom of my poster. I displayed the institutional information on all three of my products as I feel that showing what institutional com company the film was made under is a good market marketing technique if the audience is familiar with it. I displayed the same institutional information on all of my products to show consistency and to show that they are all from the same film brand. From analysing my two films, the horror genre which I decided to use was the supernatural genre, which was used in Paranormal Activity. Because of this, I looked in detail at the layout that was used for the poster and the website, and the way that the trailer was filmed and different effects that they used. As I strongly followed what was used in Paranormal Activity, I feel that this helped the consistency that was used in my trailer, poster and website. The house style which I used was the colours red, white and black. These are also the colours which are displayed on the Paranormal Activity poster and website. I also used the red, black and white within my trailer and displayed the same title throughout all three of my products as the title, The Concealed Truth, was included at the end of the trailer. This was displayed in the same font, colour and size that it was displayed on my website and poster. The typography which I used was also kept consistent and the fonts which I used were also kept the same throughout. I feel that this is important as it clearly 
displays the same use of design and style throughout all three products and makes them look more consistent and more professional. The last feature which I am going to discuss is the use of review quotes that were used within my products. I only used review quotes within my trailer and my poster and used two taglines which were used on my website. The review quotes which I used on my poster were not the same as the ones which were used in my trailer. This is, beca this is because the quotes which I used within my trailer were shorter as the audience were not given a long amount of time to read what was on the screen and I think in my trailer the shorter quotes looked more effective. Whereas on my poster I use longer review quotes, this is because the audience don't have a limited time to read the quotes and by including longer quotes on my poster it avoids having dead space and I feel the longer quotes looked more effective on my poster. Although I didn't use the same review quotes on all three of my products, I used the same typography and font, so it still made all of the quotes look consistent and it was obvious to the audience that the, that were different and it was also obvious to the audience that they were from the same film promotion products. The pull quotes which I also used were the same on the website and poster which showed consistency as they were displayed in the same colour, size and font. Although the pull quotes which I used in my trailer were used within my montage editing so I used pull quotes which were relevant to be used. Although my review quotes and pull quotes didn't match throughout all three of my products Consistency was still shown throughout because I still made sure that they were all consistent with the house style and they were all relevant within the right parts of the products.